One of the things I really love is meeting my students, meeting members of Warrior Trading. So on my trip in Italy, I was in Positano and I got a message from my student, Benjamin. He's a Warrior Pro member and he said, I'm playing with the Luxembourg Philharmonic at the festival in Ravello this coming Sunday. Would you like to join me? And I was like, sure, I, I would love to see you perform. Drove, it was maybe an hour, hour and a half, to up the mountain to Ravello. And I spent the day up there. The view was amazing. You've got these terraced gardens. It's really an incredible place. And they have this uh, sort of uh, stage where the, the musicians perform and you're looking over the water. So Benjamin, uh, he's in the Philharmonic and he plays percussion. And I asked him about what his schedule is. And I think, I, I'm trying to remember now, I think he said he uh, is works about 32 weeks out of the year which I mean uh, is an incredible job because it's not really what most of us in the US would consider a full-time job, but for him it is a full-time job. And the schedule works perfectly with trading. He's able to do his music, his practice in the mornings and by the you know 3.30, four, 4 in the afternoon, he's able to spend his afternoons focusing on trading. So he does his trading later in the day and right now they're on tour. So they do these tours and they go all over the place playing. But then when they're not touring, he gets a lot more time to focus on his trading. And trading is one of those things that, you know, you can pick it up, you can drop it off. It, it just sort of works with a sort of funny schedule. We've had people uh, that are firefighters that work, you know, these shifts were a long shift and then they have a couple of days off or uh, people who work on oil rigs who work I don't know, several months on and then they've got, you know, a month off or whatever it is. And trading is this sort of hobby. I mean, I don't have to tell you guys, you know, but it works with so many different lifestyles and careers. So, you know, you think, oh, I'm a trader. That means I don't do anything else. But that's not true. A lot of traders have side hustles or they even have full time jobs that exist outside of their trading schedule. So I'm always curious to hear your stories. Please share them in the comments. Uh, Benjamin's story is really phenomenal. It's so interesting. He um, lives right on the border of uh, Luxembourg in Germany, and he's part of the Philharmonic there. And he said uh, it's a job for him that's for life. So it's like uh, when you get that position, you're, you, he can hold it for the rest of his life which is awesome. And it gives him the ability, that flexibility to focus on studying the markets and learning how to trade and trying to master this puzzle of trading. So again, share with me your stories. I hope this one inspires you and I'll see you guys for the next episode real soon.